Now let me talk of the edge that the India has over Pakistan. First of all, India has a highly skilled manpower. We have the best in the software. We have the best engineers and doctors. It is said that as many as the total PhDs are there in Pakistan, those many are actually doing PhD in a year in India. So, in fact, the skilled manpower has led to great rise in outsourcing that we have of other countries. We have the BPOs and other such things coming to our country thanks to the skilled manpower. Next is the education in our country is far much ahead to that of the education of Pakistan and our health standards are also better than that of Pakistan. So, the skilled manpower, the education and the health are the three areas where we have an edge over Pakistan. And all this is because Pakistan has certain social taboos restricting the education of women and girls etc. But Pakistan has its own advantage, its own edge over India. First of all, there is a very skilled or good migration in the country that is at all levels from the rural to the urban areas, from the country to other countries, foreign direct investments and so on. That is the total migration process in the country is far better organized than that in India. Also the water sources in Pakistan are better than that in India. In India, so many of us do not have access to clean drinking water. But that is not the condition in Pakistan. Also, the people living there are much less in the below poverty line. In India, there are more people below poverty line. But in Pakistan, the people living under below poverty line are less than that of Pakistan. And also, though the investments in the country are less than that in India, but their utilization has been done in a better manner in the country. So, that was all about the development of the country India and assessing it and comparing it with its neighbors China and Pakistan. And that was all about your chapter. Thank you.